So I have the scene I recorded using virtual camera and the iPad app. After I recorded the camera movements with the take recorder, I naturally went to render the clip out in sequencer. And annoyingly, the app heads up display would show up in every render, even though you can't see it in the sequencer. I tried it in a fresh new project, used different render settings, tried different exporters, but nothing seemed to work. I spent hours trying to Google the solution. Then I came across this comment on YouTube. Thank you, Johnny G. You have saved my life. So far, this is the only method that worked for me. I'll show you how it's done. So you've done your recording using the app and you have some text in your cinematics folder. When you try to render these out, the unwanted heads up display will be there. So what you want to do is go to your virtual camera actor in your scene. And scroll down here to the blue VCAM component. In the output settings, untick is active, like so. Then come back up here and select the root of the actor, which is here, this one. Click on this and in the search bar, type UMG and click where it says none. And in the drop down menu, you want to search for Vcam underscore empty visible UMG. Select this one and press on this button, which says use. Now, when you go to your scene and render, your scene will render without the heads up display. Just make sure in your recorded sequence, you unlock and add your camera to the main cuts track. Also, if you have multiple virtual cameras in your scene, obviously make sure you're doing this for the one that you're rendering with. It's annoying that you have to do this every time you switch between rendering and recording, but this is the only solution I found for this issue and I want to share. Hope this helps people who were going mad because of this issue. If you found this helpful, give it a like, comment and subscribe. Cheers for watching.